a group known as the People Advocacy Organization have taken has taken taken to the streets in Benin City, accusing the state police command of complicity in the release of a suspected criminal. The protesters, while displaying several placards, urged the police to re-arrest the released suspects and charge them to court accordingly. Some of the protesters expressed disappointment at the conduct of the police. When they begin to say Nigeria police force is on five, Nigeria police force Abuja, and the subject matter for them as police is to maintain or another is being pocketed in their pockets while they, you know, embezzle money to have fat stomach. Some of us wonder how they want us who are the youth tomorrow not to go out and tow the path of lawlessness. What we know we can pay police officers, you know, to provide justice for us once we have enough, you know, legal tenders in our pockets, as the case may be. It's so sad that today, Curtis Ugo is promoting a native war in the land of Benin. And at the same time, I'm giving him warning to stop using the name of the great about Benin as a weapon of intimidation to intimidate Nigeria citizens. And also at the same time, he should be careful of what he's trying to promote in our land. We don't need native war. It's not because, as you alleged here, that the command compromise or they want to pervert justice. You were just acting on ignorance by saying that. Because if you had known how the Nigerian police force is uh, model, you will know that we have a uh, uh, hierarchy of uh, offices here. You know what it means to, for character assassination? I'm going to sue him at the appropriate time. As I speak to you, I have uh, two petitions.